14.3 degrees, 14.3. Starting mileage is 29775, 29775. Hey YouTube, it's your almost nine. It's been a few days since I rode. Some kind of slushy snowstorm came through and it laid a nice layer of ice on our driveway. It was that type of ice where you know if you can get uh, your shovel underneath it, it'll all crack and pop and come apart but some parts didn't come apart like our lower half had to put salt on that plus our subdivision had ice and there's a couple other roads that had ice but now it's clear so I'm out <coughs> so yesterday I was talking with a co-worker and she was talking about uh, her career she has an MBA she also uh, is currently a project manager or learning to become a project manager. But she really wasn't sure where her career was going and what she really wanted to do. And then for whatever reason the, the conversation came uh, came on upon me and she was asking me why I wasn't considering going back to school and getting an MBA or, or whatever. So hopefully this makes sense. I, uh, I've been a software developer for uh, and I don't know how long I've been a software developer. 13, 14, 15, 14 years? Something. Quite a while. And if you didn't know, uh, I assume many of you do, my last job, I actually went from uh, whoops, that a software developer two jobs ago to becoming a director. You know, the opportunity was given to me you know, a lot of people are all about title and money, and this opportunity was presented, so I took it. And uh, life was good. I worked for a very small company. The I grew the IT department from like one person to nine, nine or ten people. I'm not, I can't even remember now. Uh, the, the organization, you know, quadruple in size, and everything is good. But with all companies that that grow larger. At some point, you get a lot of people in like leadership positions, and eventually you get a lot of people, uh, I'll just call it politics, a lot of office politics and bureaucracy, which was weird because um, to me what politics are is really just us trying to like say how much better we are than somebody else, when in reality, we're all working for the same company. Why are we arguing against each other? We should be all working together because we're supposed to be trying to better the business. Well, you take that and the fact that I was putting in a lot of hours, um, like 60 hours was like a light week for me. It was very common for me to work. Is this ice? Uh, no. It was very common for me to work like, you know, 80, sometimes maybe 100 hours. It just depended. I worked a lot of nights and weekends. Um, but at the time, you know, I just did it because I was doing good things. But um, like I said, the organization organization got bigger. There's a lot of politics, and so for me, you know, a lot of people, you know, like the hours were wearing me down, but not really because I could see the benefits, right? But uh, the politics is what really killed me. Um, it was just frustrating because uh, with a lot of hard work, you can see the payoffs, right? But with a lot of politics, you know, what payoffs are you seeing? Yeah, yeah, I'm better than you, but we're all on the same team, so why are we fighting with each other? So I decided to leave there, go back to being a software developer, and, you know, whatever, for whatever reason, uh, I have a tendency to go from software developer to some form of leadership, and now I'm back to a team lead, which right now is perfect for me. I don't... I don't want to be a director again. I don't want to be a VP of anything. I don't want to be a CIO, CTO. I just don't want to deal with the politics. And the other great thing now is with my current job, I don't work nights and I don't work weekends. I don't carry a pager. So if you can get the common theme here, <laughs> I don't want the higher title. I don't necessarily need, so I would get, I would have more education to get that better position. 
but I'm basically saying I don't want the higher position, so I don't necessarily need the education to get to those higher titles. Um, I've already been there, <coughs> already done that, to, and now that I've had the title and I had the money, if you want to call it that, it wasn't actually that good of a pay, but uh, uh, I've been there, I've done that, and you know what? It wasn't worth it. And now I can uh, work a lot less hours, have very you know similar responsibilities, you know, leadership position, and you know what? Actually, I'm actually getting paid more now than I was before. Figure, go, go figure that out. So, I don't know if any of you guys are in the same situation. I've been, I've talked and whatever with so many people, and they're all about get that education, get that title, and it's, it's kind of weird because sometimes I want to say, you know, look, that's great that you want to get the education, that's great that you want that title, but I don't think you realize how much work it is. And even if you can handle the work, I don't know if you can handle the politics because um, I think it just takes a different type of person to actually deal with the, uh, the, the politics. But, you know, basically a politician. A politician can deal with the politics. Um, but, you know, if you're just a software developer and you're good at being a software developer, I'm guessing you're probably not going to be good with the politics or it's going to wear you down or burn you out. Anyways, that's my story. All right, so let's see, insert joke here. A man was walking down the street when all of a sudden he heard a voice say, stop, a brick is going to hit you on the head and you'll die. So the man stopped and a brick fell right in front of him, just missing his face. And the man was relieved and he continued walking. And then he heard the voice say, stop, or a car is going to run you over. And the man stopped. And just then, a car came speeding around the corner, sliding sideways and creening off the road. The man was relieved, and he said, Who are you? And the voice said, I'm your guardian angel. And the man said, Well, where were you last week when I got married? And I'll talk to you guys later. Ending mileage 29815, 29815.